Tonight, 70% of the ballots in the Supreme Court race have been counted. With, but with a little more than a week left in that recount, there are new questions about 18 votes from Sauk County. News 3's Maria Guerrero now with the story. And these 18 votes coming from nuns at a monastery. The Government Accountability Board calling this an unfortunate lesson. This, you know, is a clerk who wasn't following the requirements. One, she shouldn't be delivering them except by mail uh, to, to the convent. Um, and two, and which is most important, is that uh, the law is very clear about witnessing um, and signatures of the voters. Valley of Our Lady Monastery in Prairie du Sac calling this an honest mistake. 18 nuns here voted by absentee ballot like they always do. The problem is the ballots were not signed by a witness as required by state law. The GAB says the municipal clerk in the town of Sumter failed to check the ballots when she was picking them up. If she had, she could have gone back to get the signatures, thus making the votes count. A person's ballot is a very personal thing and to have uh, their ballot not counted because uh, either the clerk uh, didn't do their responsibility or uh, the voter didn't follow through with what's required by law, you know, is devastating and you hope that you learn from that. And we've, we've had that situation and uh, the next time the voter is better prepared and in this time both the voters and the clerk will be better prepared. Of these 18 votes essentially thrown out by the canvassing board of Sauk County, 14 were for Supreme Court Justice David Prosser, four for challenger Joanne Kloppenberg. Prosser's campaign has filed several objections to having these votes not counted. Kloppenberg has not. All right, Maria Guerrero reporting that. Maria, thank you very much.